Hi everyone, what's going on? It's Natalie here with another message for you guys. Hope everyone is doing well today. We're gonna tap in see what spirit needs us to know right now. Keep in mind, energies can be reversed, time is fluid. I do astrology readings on TikTok, so you're more than welcome to look at my TikTok to see uh, what your astrology reading says for this week, okay? Um, and also, if you guys needed a more personal reading, you're more than welcome to email me. My email is in the description box below for you down there, okay? Let's see, what is the energy please for the collective? <clears throat> what's the energy please for the collective all right so we have the king of pentacles that came out first all right so something here about finances is very important um this could be talking about a uh, masculine who's getting his finances together hmm, what is this two of cups okay um might be romanticized but this may also be business relationship too hmm this may also be business for some of you guys. All right, let's see what else. Okay, the Six of Swords. Someone is getting their money together and they're moving on, definitely. Or someone is getting their, two people are getting their money together and they're moving on is what I'm getting here. All right, yeah, we have the Six of, six of Wands in the reverse here and the world in the reverse. Someone here is being, I don't know, someone, I guess someone feels humiliated, okay? with two people being together or they will be or i don't know it's like a pride thing going on with this person with the six of pentacles here it looks like you're going to be given something yeah something about pride pride goes in your favor not this person's favor huh someone okay this is kind of going with my last reading I, f I guess someone feels like they're owed something here. What else? And if they don't get it, they will be humiliated in public or they feel like no one would respect them or no one will want to be around them or something like that. There's like an image. Something about reputation is here. Yeah, three of swords in reverse. Could be someone's ex. Could be this masculine's ex, okay? This masculine is healing from heartbreak. He's healing from betrayal. He's over something. He's not affected by something. We have the Nine of Cups in reverse with the Hangman here. There's something here also about like beliefs. In this Two of Cups, in this Two of Cups card, is two women together. So this could be same sex that's coming together, or this is someone here who's like they. They're forced to see a different perspective of somebody else's life and what they want to do here. They're uncomfortable. They're not pleased by it. They feel like it should be their spot. I'm getting something about white and black, okay? Someone could be moving towards a white woman or moving towards a black woman. It doesn't really matter, but someone feels like that's not right. Okay, let's see what else. Page of Wands in the reverse. And then we have the Six of Cups in the reverse. Okay. Um, looks like someone here has trauma. Ten of Cups over someone else's happiness. Yeah, I, I feel like someone is in denial. Um, this is kind of reminding me of a Taurus reading that I did last night. Um, someone can't accept that someone is actually changing. Changing their life, changing their dynamic, changing everything. Their type. Six of Cups in reverse is bad memories. So someone is in denial about this person because they might not have treated this person too well. This masculine may not have treated this past person too well, but he's changing or something is happening here. Okay. Now, this is where things get sticky because we say things like, oh, well, you're going to get karma for treating your ex this way or that way. Sometimes you don't get karma, okay? Like, I'm going to just say that right now. There's something here about um, men and they change who the, for who they want to change for type of energy here. And that's fine. Let them change for whoever they want to change for. But I feel like someone's not accepting this. They're not willing to let this person go. Clarify the Six of Swords in the reverse. If someone treated you so terribly, you should be able to let them go. 
You shouldn't be trying to hold them hostage, remind them of everything bad that they've done to you. This is why you can't move forward. You might as well be with me because I'm the one that deserves a good life with you. I'm the one that is supposed to, you know, it's giving me something like that. It's like whoever this masculine treated terribly in the past um, due to ignorance or, you know, just, I don't know, maybe they were younger or whatever. Um, they feel like this ex feels like they should still be getting karma for that. Instead of this ex just moving on and finding someone better than this masculine, he or she is going to continue to, I don't know, I feel like they want to traumatize this person or they refuse to see that this masculine can change. Clarify the Six of Swords. Or this could be you. If this is a feminine trying to move on, maybe you weren't uh, so, maybe you're probably toxic in a relationship in your past. Your ex really feels like you'll never change and you'll do the same thing with your new person. That's the energy going on right now. Six of Wands in the reverse. I feel like this person here is just, yeah, they're mad because they know that they'll be humiliated if this person does treat someone better. Tower in the reverse. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. Because something here was a blessing the whole time or they know that someone is a blessing. People are going to be looking at this person like, why don't you have that blessing? Or why aren't you with that person? Or why are they treating this person better than they treated you? It's going to be something like that. Yeah, because they wanted a fresh start and to heal. Some people notice that they're toxic individuals and they're like, well, I can't fix it with this person. I can't fix it with the person that I hurt. I got to go fix it with someone else. And it's kind of, it seems kind of wrong. But at the same time, you can't heal from the person that hurt you. You can't expect the person that wronged you to make everything right again. You got to go find someone else to make something right, basically is what I'm saying. So if there's a feminine out here that needs to move on from a masculine who has changed and he is better now. And just go find someone else. Because if you're, if you're going to continue to make things right with this masculine, you're going to always remember the past of what they've done to you. It's always going to hurt. You're always going to hang it over their head. You're always going to feel bitter about it. This masculine may know that he messed up a relationship, but he wants to make it right with someone else and not the person that he ruined. And I mean, that's, I don't know. In the past, I used to think that that was wrong. But now I'm in this mindset where like, well, I don't want to heal from the person that hurt me anyway. I don't want the person that hurt me to heal me. I want to move forward, find someone that will never, ever, ever do it. Never even think about doing it. So it's like, it, it's kind of like that type of energy here. So it looks like someone is a blessing. Someone missed out on a blessing. Um, they wanted someone to receive a tower. They're not receiving a tower. They're not, they're not in the tower moment. They wanted something to be devastated. They want they wanted someone to be devastated and fall apart after breaking up with them. That's not working. This person's actually maybe getting a new job or something. Yes, yeah, so we have the eight of cups in reverse. Someone cannot walk away from this person because they're smart or they have plans or something like that. They want to know what this person is up to. Clarify the world in reverse. But they see it as something unfinished. Two of Pentacles. I feel like they're looking at this man's money, what he has to offer. Like, oh, that should be given to me. Because remember when you cheated on me back in 1992? Yeah, so we have the Empress in reverse. Yep. The star. She wants some of that healing energy that this person has. She feels like it's not finished because maybe she's uh, juggling finances or she doesn't have much. Yeah, the full card. She wants to be part of the new clean slate that this person is trying to start here. But it's not going to work. Something is over with. And someone is coming into a lot of money. Someone is coming into a lot of money, but whoever this person's ex is feels like they should have their hands on it. Resonating with my last reading. Someone really feels like they are owed something. <sighs> I, I thought the whole idea of women breaking up with men was to go start a new job, go get a new house, find a new man. Do like that's the women's, you know, mo when it comes to a breakup. 
go to the gym, get fit. This woman is not doing that. She's expecting something from this man here. Clarify the three of swords in reverse. High priestess in the reverse. This person isn't following their intuition or there's a secret coming out or this person is exposed for who they are. They didn't know that this person would heal and just move forward. Yeah, they didn't know this person wouldn't be defended or protected. They expected to be like protected by this person. So let, let me just be, I don't want to be biased in this situation because I am still a woman. All right. It's like, yes, your ex hurt you. So you would think that this, per, this, per, this masculine is a good man though. You would think that this good man will protect you, right? But you can't expect certain things like that. This is why women in this day and age are told to be strong and love yourself and, you know, self-love movement and stuff like that. Because men aren't going to go back to their ex and fix them unless they want something from their ex. And this man wants nothing from this feminine at all. He doesn't even want her forgiveness. He doesn't want money from her. He doesn't want a, a, a place to sleep from her. He doesn't want anything from her. So he doesn't feel like he should be fixing anything from with her trigger but I, I feel like this is giving me clarify the uh two of cups the page of pentacles yeah someone has potential i feel like he's moving towards someone with potential or he's potentially potentially giving someone an offer page of pentacles with the two of cups The Eight of Pentacles in reverse. And I feel like in a way you can sympathize with this woman. If this masculine is coming towards you, you can still sympathize with this woman here. Because maybe you have been in this position before. But you moved on. You realize this man isn't going to recompensate anything with me. So you move forward. You found someone better. Eight of Swords in the reverse. I, I really feel like someone is trying to trap someone else's energy because they feel like they're owed something. Clarify the nine of cups in the reverse. Someone is very displeased. We have the moon here. And judgment in the reverse. There's also something about like this female doesn't know how to track this person or like She's lost. She doesn't know what the heck is going on. Seven of Cups is here. She's thinking. She's trying to judge the situation. She can't judge it. It's like she's lost. She's lost in the sauce with the moon card here. She's in fear. She's trying to figure out who the Queen of Cups is. She probably doesn't even know who you are. You guys could be a Pisces. I feel like also this uh, feminine is trying to escape judgment in her own life. She doesn't want to be wrong at all. She's trying to like find ways to move around being wrong. This woman cannot support herself or something like that. And it's kind of like making everything worse. Like this has to be, she has to make herself. I don't know if this is you guys, if this is you guys listen to me very clearly. You have to become an advocate for things like this. If a man treated you wrong, move on, teach your children to do better, teach other women to do better. Be an advocate for stuff like this. Don't try to hold on to the man that did you wrong. You're going to look crazy in front of everybody. I feel like someone is looking like someone is embarrassed right now in the community. I feel like people will see what this person is doing. But for some reason, but no one is i feel like no one is telling this person though they're just letting this person do their thing clarify the hangman uh i feel like this feminine is a lost cause hangman yeah ace of swords in reverse they're a lost cause they're in denial they refuse to see the truth yeah they they'd rather be in a seven of cups they'd rather be delusional three of cups in the reverse and I feel like their friends let them be this way too. Like no one is telling this person that they're wrong for trying to keep this man back. 
This female may have also like cheated too. Yeah, Page of Swords in Reverse. Something here about lies. Someone's lies are keeping them stuck or someone is seeing, I feel like someone's friends sees this person's lies for what they are. Like, didn't you just, I feel like this person had a baby by someone else too. Didn't you just have a whole child on this man? Or didn't you cheat on this man? Or didn't you run their name through the dirt on the internet? Something here going on like that. Like someone is investigating this person. They see that this person is actually very uh, childish. They're a liar. They're clearly in denial. They're spying on somebody because they're in denial. I'm seeing a nice porch, like a porch with um, not street lights on the porch, but like it looks like a street light, but a smaller street light. It's a porch though. And the porch has like nice evergreen bushes and a black gate. I don't know whose porch I'm looking at, but it's really pretty. It looks really pretty in the winter time and it looks really pretty like when the weather changes, I'm seeing something about like New York or Pittsburgh or something like that. Very pretty porch. I don't know why I'm seeing that. Someone likes to hang ornaments off of it and during the holidays or something. I don't know. Uh, page of Wands in the reverse. Maybe you guys are gonna be getting this type of home. Okay. So we have the three of pentacles here with the ten of wands. Knight of pentacles in the reverse. Someone is receiving bad news as someone is working with everyone but them. It's like someone someone that definitely counted them out of a collaboration or something out here. And they have to do something all on their own, but they cannot do anything on their own right now. Someone is struggling. They're carrying a lot of burdens. To be honest with you, I feel bad for this feminine. Because I feel like we all been through a situation where like a man did us wrong. And then like he ran off and treated someone else way better. Some men's karma is that the person that they run off to does them dirty too, but not this divine masculine. This divine masculine doesn't deserve doesn't deserve to be treated wrong. Clarify the uh, six of cups in the reverse. This is giving me like a high school relationship though, like a really young relationship. They've been together for years, and for some reason, this woman wants to full grown man now he's a full grown man now to be accountable for everything that she's has has that he's ever done to her hermit in the reverse this person isn't seeing something clearly five of swords is here give me one more for that they feel like they're owed something same energy i got in the last reading queen of swords is here death in the reverse three of wands reverse king of swords someone also try to cut off telepathic communication between you two or they're trying to do it now. You may have telepathic communication with somebody. They're trying to cut it off. They feel like they, it's their owed to cut that off. Yeah, spying. There's something here about an institution. Maybe someone belongs in an institution. I'm not even going to lie. This person is always trying to get back. Get back at somebody. But there's a transformation here. They're trying to figure out who the divine feminine is. Or you're just very different from this uh, feminine here. This masculine wants peace. He doesn't want to uh, be involved. I feel like someone feels like all their good years were wasted. And they're no longer wasting time. Yeah, we have the Ten of Pentacles here. With the Seven of Wands in the reverse. Someone, not can, someone cannot block your future, your destiny, your legacy. Someone is realizing that they can't stop it. Okay, there's some commitment coming out here. Some real serious commitment. Ten of Pentacles with the Hierophant and the Death Card in the reverse. Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Someone is trying to stop this, but it's not going to work. They cannot stop it. 
basically is what I'm getting here. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Seven of Swords in the reverse with the King of Swords. Yeah, someone is being smart. Someone also got caught cheating, like I said. They got caught cheating. They got caught being reckless. They didn't want this person to be aware of what they were doing. Someone is just known as like a cheater. Someone that's really reckless. This masculine wants to be single. What else? Judgment in the reverse. Yeah, like I said, someone is trying to escape judgment. Someone has come up. Someone is coming up with ways to make money right now. in the reverse hmm two of wands in reverse yeah I feel like also there's uh, a masculine in here being in, in an investigative energy right now and he's watching someone like be messy in front of them he doesn't like it give me another one for that he's like he's caught somebody being messy Page of Cups in the reverse. King of Wands reverse. Justice in reverse with the Five of Cups. I'm also getting like this is an energy where there was two mat there's two masculines out here. One of them tried to guide this person down the wrong path away from you. Um, it's not working. Someone sees this person as like not they're not truthful or they're always trying to sabotage things or they try to guide someone down the wrong path. Why the death card in the reverse? Yeah, the chariot in the reverse. Someone is like um, really reckless and they'll never change. Some people never change. Ten of cups in the reverse is a group. Oh, I'm picking up off another story. Every time I use different cards, I pick up on another story. Um, there's a masculine out here who has dysfunctional family members or something. He has his eyes on becoming successful or having a legacy but I feel like it's not it may not work out between you and this other person because they have messy people around them knight of wands in the reverse so divine feminine you could be moving on from somebody that has messy family members and you're just like I'd rather choose someone with no family how about that and this person is like really regretful for doing an injustice to you or putting these people above you. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. She's the culprit here. Five of Cups in the reverse with the Ten of Swords. She had no remorse in uh, ending a relationship or doing something in the past towards you with some children or something like that. So yeah, I feel like this uh, female plays with people's children. Like she attacks the children and the family she's really reckless she cheats she's uh materialistic here yeah page of swords over she's also stalking you she can act like she's not stalking you all she wants to she is but she lies on you she just adds things on that doesn't make any sense yeah the truth is coming out though you're celebrated or something this person is jealous that you're um balanced here or you're getting something here or you're celebrated yeah so this queen of pentacles in reverse is like she pretends like she's very stable or something but she's not it's all a lie this person lies about their lifestyle and they lie about your lifestyle and i feel like this masculine is attached to this woman here someone just makes things up and who wants to be around people like that seven of swords in the reverse Never mind. Seven of Swords in the reverse. Two of Swords in the reverse. So it looks like someone is realizing, yes, my family is messy. Yes, my family is annoying. But we have to, yeah, secrets are all coming out. Everything is exposed. Yep. This person wasn't using their intuition before. Um, someone lied to this person. They try to like guide this person on the wrong path and say, oh, you guys broke up because they're promiscuous or you guys broke up because you weren't supposed to be together anyway or 
you guys broke up because blah 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 no they broke up because you guys broke up because of their dysfunctional family let's just keep it real so you don't want anything to do with this person here clarify judgment in the reverse nobody wants to be around these people so this man is gonna have this man his dating life is gonna suck because his family sucks that's what i'm getting for this judgment in the reverse yep five of pentacles in reverse with the devil here so someone's trying to escape judgment they cannot i'm also getting like someone is obsessed with people that are not in poverty like them yeah emperor in reverse and they try to control them they try to keep them under um control that's another reason why you're looking for better yeah because you can't take this anymore every time you get a little piece of money here they come it's weird this person is obsessed with trying to control the dynamic of a situation it's an entity on them they can't even help it it's like something about their bloodline their bloodline's all messed up Someone is like in extreme poverty and they need energy for their cult or their family. That's what this is. That's all this is about. Clarify full in the reverse. Yeah, the high priestess in the reverse. Dark high priestess energy. They're being ran by something. Nine of cups. Yeah, they're saying go over to the divine feminine or go over to the divine masculine. Bring energy over here. Yeah, someone that's free, independent, that dropped them. I thought the Divine Feminine, I don't know. I feel like they, they try to, um, <sighs> this is a basic in-law story. They try to make it seem like you weren't part of the family. Now all of a sudden that, now all of a sudden they're in poverty. Now all of a sudden you're a part of the family. I don't get it. Someone can't walk away from you though. This masculine here is in the upright and he can't walk away from you, but no, I don't feel like this is, I really don't feel like this is uh, for you. I don't feel like it's going to work out. Like I said, so I don't feel like someone will ever change. They want to do the right thing. They want a legacy, but they're trying to drag their dirty bloodline into it. And it's never going to work out. The two of wands in the reverse. This person will always hate you because you rejected them. You don't want their apology or none of that. Yeah, we have the lovers here. Someone was guided away from you. Justice. It was supposed to happen that way. King of Cups. So that you can have someone that is actually emotionally balanced. Also, I'm getting like... Someone went the wrong way so that someone else can have you. So just thank this person for believing in their family so much that they ended up freeing you up of some energy and you can go be with someone else. Or so that you can get your justice because there's something here about these people. They're very unjust. They're very messy people. Cut by the paper cups in the reverse. Yep, three of wands is here. You're rejecting their offer. They're also... In this energy of like projecting towards you because you're looking at something better. You're releasing them. You're looking at something better. And they're in the energy of like talking crap about you because you don't want them back. Tower. Oh, well. I feel like also someone tried to set a trap for you recently. It didn't work out. Yeah, you can't have a family with people that like to fight all day. There's people out here that just want to fight all day. They don't want to really team up together and do anything uh, important for the community. None of that. It's just fighting. It's all competition. So someone is like uh, misguided or something. I don't know. They thought that you were going to fall for something and you're not. There's someone in the family. It might not be the person, but there's someone in the family. There's an entity in the family with um, the energy of extreme poverty. And they're trying, they need energy from you. And they're not getting it. Let's see, what's the energy? We got patience here and change your focus. Yeah, someone always wanted you to wait on them. 
And you're just like, nah, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to focus on something else here. Giving and receiving is here. You could be actually be getting gifts or something or you're giving. You're focusing on people that actually matter. Courage is here. I find the inner I find the inner strength to face fear with confidence. You have a lot of confidence to move forward and do something else. Someone may want to like give you something, and I don't know. It's like I don't feel like you're focused on it. We have loneliness. I know that I'm never alone. Worry. So someone that isolated you and left you alone only it's only making them worried now because you're you're focusing on other things you're focusing on what you're getting not not what you're not getting from this person here and that's worrying them you got master here yep you mastered your emotions or you're getting gifts because it's the way the universe is congratulating you for mastering your energy or staying balanced yes we have teach here someone wants you to teach them how to be courageous i guess someone wants uh they want to know how you're doing something here. Something about you having patience and changing your focus here. You have high self-esteem is what I'm getting. Someone is very worried because they left you alone. what this person won't do another one will i feel like that's the whole theme of this reading like in the last deck of cards it's like a female need, this feminine needs to know that what this person won't do for them someone else will and i feel like you realize that you're the divine feminine you had to learn this with your ex someone is is trying to um figure out how you did something how did you stop worrying about a person we have robbery here. Yeah, someone just want, wants to exploit you anyway. They were taking advantage of your patience, so they lost you. Loss, readiness, they weren't ready for it. They weren't prepared to lose you, but they were prepared to take from you and rob you or whatever, or exploit you or use you in a weird way. And that's how they lost you. Yes, yeah, so you have perseverance. You're still moving forward. You're not in the energy of waiting for anybody. They thought that you were going to wait for them. So they fell for that trap. I, I'm also getting like they set their own trap here. Confinement. Third wheel in the reverse. I'm also getting like someone is stuck in the middle too. Whoever your ex ran off to doesn't want them anymore. So they're stuck. It's like they're trapped now. Someone could actually be going to jail or something too. Yeah, we have compromise in reverse. They see that you're done. You're worn out with compromising with this person. You may be focusing on your profession now. They weren't ready for something. Like someone wasn't ready. They're never ready for anything. It's just, they're always trying to figure out like how to exploit somebody. Yeah, commitment is here. So someone is stuck on a toxic commitment or a contract and you're just moving forward. It's, it doesn't affect you. Yeah, we have idea here. I feel like someone else doesn't have ideas. They need your ideas or they need your courage. They need your strength to get through everything here. Someone someone is trapped now. They got tricked. They got tricked into going against you. They got tricked into doing you dirty. They got tricked into doing all these weird things and now they cannot come back. Same thing for Divine Masculine. Your ex got tricked into doing a lot of things because her friends wouldn't tell her that she was wrong. And now you're not going back. Someone here has new ideas. And they want to start something brand new. All right. So this is your guys' reading. Hope this resonated for you. If it did, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel. So you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.